Hello ladies and gentlemen, Legatus here, bringing you a video of Metro Last Light, the sequel to Metro 2033. Alright, first things first, let's go into the options menu. Uh, there is a lack of options, to say the least. Uh, most of the options fall under this quality setting, which changes your textures, your uh, depth of field, and all of those, which really sucks, because I'd like to change those individually. However, you can change SSAA and all these things separately. Uh, I do have it set to normal, because I do not get very good frame rates for this game, I don't know why. Uh, been having some issues with games lately. I have a GTX 680 if people want to know. Um, but yeah, it does recommend that you have a Titan for this game, so it does look good at normal. I am not going to complain about how the game looks. I think it looks just fine. So, uh, pretty much amazing, actually. Alright, uh, I will show you this new game thing. People have been com complaining about this Ranger mode and how it is a pre-order bonus. And uh, that is the mode I will be playing, actually, Ranger Hardcore mode is the mode I will be showing. Because Angry Joe, for example, he is playing the game in original mode, and I thought I'd be one of those people. Uh, I think Total Biscuit also is in original mode, so there just has been a lack of other people going into Ranger mode, but I kind of want to go into that, and why this mode, in my opinion, isn't worth five bucks. Because I've been playing it quite a bit, and uh, alright, we'll just jump into it now. Yeah, there's a quick loading screen I cut out of that because it does have spoilers. Uh, I am going to avoid having spoilers in this video as much as I can, and if uh, something does come up that I just can't cut out, I will warn you uh, via annotations. Alright, so here is a situation where I have to sneak past these guards. Uh, one here is a breaker where I can uh, turn the lights off, which uh, will definitely help my sneak attempt out. Um, I am on ranger mode, so there is no HUD. I'm just gonna go over here, stab him in the neck. Effective way to get past him. Uh, there is no HUD, and I kind of wish they did it better, because generally when you think no HUD, it means that everything's going to be translated on the screen in some other way, right? And uh, it's just not the case. Like, um, I am playing with a controller, uh... And it's just really bad. Let's go into the options menu to show you the controller. Uh, controls, presets, and as you see, if you look at all these, where is the control for putting on your mask? Where is the control for bringing out your recharger for your light? It just doesn't tell you. And apparently with the HUD, it would tell you, but that part just is removed because there is no HUD. They didn't eloquently put it back into the game. It's just not there. And, uh, you would, you'd probably complain, like, well, why are you playing with a controller, then? This is PC, right? Uh, how's the mouse and keyboard? And mouse and keyboard, it's not a problem. All the, uh, options are there, and, uh, they're all rebindable. However, the game is only at 70 FPS. I mean, not FPS, uh, FOV. So I am sitting farther away from my computer so that I don't get a headache, and that is why I'm playing with a controller, because I just can't play the game any other way. Uh, so, it's not too great. Anyways, uh... To tell you what the controls were for putting on the mask, I have to hold the left button, left bumper, and then press X. It took me 10 minutes to figure that shit out. <laughs> and uh, for uh, the recharger, I think it's hold left bumper and hit left on the D-pad. So yeah, not to uh, well organize the ranger mode. Also, ammo. Um, they do not tell you your ammo. There is no way of checking your ammo unless you're at a store in a... Uh, location on the map. Uh, you'll run into these hubs where you can buy ammo and buy weapon upgrades. Oh shit. Well, now we're in the shitstorm. Alright. Well, yeah, you die fast in hard, uh, hardcore ranger mode. But they die fast too. It's actually a complete game overhaul. It's not just a uh, difficulty setting. Which, uh, I'm enjoying Ranger Mode. With all of this said, I am very much thoroughly enjoying the game. However, a lot of this does bother me. Just gonna... Let this guy walk past further, and then... Get you like that. Have these guys talk about rats. There we go. Dealt with. So yeah, also, another thing about no HUD, 
there was a moment in the game where I had to button mash X to uh, move something. Instead, I just had to guess. It took me a couple seconds to figure out exactly what I was supposed to be doing. Oh, shit. Fuck! Ah, oh, god damn it. Alright, I'm just gonna run into here. I don't like using that gun because it's kind of a... Uh, my, my only stealth weapon. Oh, shit. Alright, uh... I'd like to use grenades in this situation, but I don't know how to equip grenades quite yet. I have not figured out how to do that. So, I'm just going to be using the shotgun. Come on, you armored freaks! Die! There we go. Under... I haven't actually found any explosive barrels in the game yet, so I doubt that's going to explode. Also, I think uh, health packs have been removed from the game, or at least I haven't figured out a reason or how to use them, so it's just sort of wait as this fades away. It's taking, taking its time. Don't normally have this much trouble headshotting people. Might be just the pressure of having to commentate while doing this. I don't know. Either way, this is boring. Let's go around. These guys can be pretty oblivious at times, but they aren't oblivious right now. Oh, mother. That's that. All right. Let's try to just sneak past most of these enemies this time. Maybe that'll be a better approach. Done it before, but I don't know. I just like to loot their bodies. Let this guy get closer again. Come on. You're oblivious that I'm here because it's dark. And there we go. There we go. That's the most efficient way of killing because it does not use ammo. Because ammo is pretty scarce, but uh, I do have like three magazines for this gun, which uh, isn't too bad. I could probably kill all these guys with this gun if I got headshots and was efficient with it. Um, but it's just a lot easier to use the knives. Let's uh, just examine this area a little bit better. Set. Yeah, see my watch down there? If it turns blue, that means they can see me. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Yes, good. If you press X, you can. Oh shit, he's looking this way. Die. <laughs> he doesn't even see that his friend just died. Yeah, like I said, they could be pretty oblivious. Oh, something sees off. Maybe it's the dead guy. Okay, this might be bad, but I gotta try it. There. Don't sound the alarm. Don't, don't do it, don't do it. Don't sound the alarm! Because if they sound the alarm, two guys in armor are gonna storm through here again. I don't think they've actually seen me. They just know that I'm here. Fuck you guys! God damn it. Alright, they don't know where I am. They just know that I'm here. So they're sending the alarm. And these guys will be oblivious. And hopefully I can stab them in the neck. Come on, come on, come on. Oh god. Normally there's a vibration if I am able to assassinate and it just didn't happen, so that means that I couldn't assassinate that enemy. 
Ah, why? All right. Maybe this is a bad area to show off since I'm not actually getting past it. Hmm. What do you mean, people? I mean rats. Kill the rats. Come on. Oh, fuck. Now I gotta find that knife. Yeah, for that you just literally just button mash. Come on. Come on. You don't know where I am. Admit it. Okay, now I know where I am. Which means I gotta run. Because I can't actually engage these guys or else I will die. Which is never good. Did I loot these guys completely? I feel like I didn't. No, I did not. Being lazy. Not good. Fuck. Okay. Is there another way around? We could just hide here. No, I can't shoot that. Damn it! Oh, amazing. I don't want to eat that. I'm lead intolerant. Whoa. Yeah, use alt fire to shoot both shots at once. That way they die just that much faster. Yeah, there is a uh, auto-aim that is on by default that you can't turn off in this game. I think there might be a workaround, but I don't know it. For a controller, you can't turn it off, though. I know that much. Like, uh, if I go options, controls, controller, uh, sensitivity, and you can change aim assist off. However, I heard it's also on for the keyboard that you can't turn it off. I don't know if that option works for that, though. It might. Never did find that, whatchamacallit, the knife I threw randomly. Missed. Well, I can go back for it. This guy's fucked. Ready for it. Damn it! I'm supposed to get you in the back. There you go. I gotta stop using that double shot. It's just not efficient against those enemies. For some reason, it pulled me out of the game. I have no idea why. But it pauses the game if that happens, so... Not too big of a problem. Alright, so we cleared that area. Um, sort of brute forced my way through it, but... Yeah, that is Ranger Hardcore Mode. Um, basically, don't get shot and fuck you. Could have not killed him, but he's a Nazi, so yeah. He can die. Actually, I don't think these guys are Nazis. I think these are, uh, these are the Reds. Oh, well. He's still my enemy. Yeah, there are a lot of occasions in the game where an enemy will just surrender themselves to you. However, uh, I'm a bad person, so I just kill them all the time. Uh, one guy, he was surrendering, and I saw that he had throwing knives taped on his arm. So I was just like, alright, you could throw those at me if I walk away. And there's no way to restrain them or anything. You literally just don't shoot them. So, I tend to not trust people, especially on this difficulty where if I do trust them and I shouldn't have trusted them, they will shoot me in the back and I'll die pretty much instantly. But it's cool how that's there, and I'm sure it'll open up a lot of different things if you do let them live. I don't really know what'll happen in those situations, but it's cool nonetheless to have people be like, Oh, I, f I surrender. And you're aiming a gun at them. 
There might be story elements behind the store. Or just a mask. Either way. Oh. Got to the next checkpoint. That helps. Am I in the... Yes, I am in the light. No, I'm not in the light. Okay. Let's see. Oh, there's breakers over there. Can I sneak over to this? Yeah, seems like I can. That's good. And they don't seem to care. Yeah, the AI is kind of weird in this game. They don't care if the lights turn off. And I'll just slit your throat. No big deal. I don't know what you're doing here, but now you're dead. Loot your stuff. Oh, I was in the light for a second. Why is that still... Wasn't that the animation for welding? I guess not. <laughs> okay, I'm hoping I can distract them by doing this. Awesome. Nope, didn't work. Oh, Jesus, don't. 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 Don't aim your flashlights at me, please. Could you not? Oh, shit. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, I don't, I don't know where I am right now, but I'm hiding. Seems to be working. I'm hiding in between two pipings. Things. Oh, no, I'm not hiding. Oh, shit. Alright, well. Um, turns out, if you throw a knife at them, it does not work as distraction. Unfortunate. Just gonna do that again. Just gonna walk because nobody sees me. Yeah, basically, if that light is not there, you are invisible. Unless they're alert, then uh, you're more visible because they will see you. They'll be uh, looking for you a little bit more, more intensely. Oh, there's no way to turn that off. And I'm out of knives. And that guy just teleported on my screen. I don't know what that was about. Shit. I do have a suppressor on this, which... Oh, God. Okay. That did not... My suppressor did not help. They know where I am. Okay. I'm just gonna go to the safety place. My happy place. Yeah, I don't think you can wait for them to unwind, so to speak, where they uh, just sort of reset their estates and go back to work. That doesn't seem to happen on this difficulty. Oh, uh, yeah. Wow. God damn it. All right. I think that concludes this video. Um... I'll continue smashing my face against the wall that is this game's difficulty. Uh, yeah, probably with the video off, I'll probably do better. It seemed like I was doing better up until this point. Oh god! Oh god! That was a that was a trigger slip. Um, okay, we'll just play this out, and then after this, I will end the video. Okay, why is it getting all smoky in here? This is. Oh, they're they're smoking me out. Ah. Yeah, they tried to smoke me out. Uh, I will be coming out with a Sanctum 2 video, either today or tomorrow. Uh, so look forward to that. Uh, besides that, I am just going to shoot people. And die. <laughs> this difficulty does not fuck around. Alright, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And like the video, and all that stuff. Doing that usual YouTuber dance at the end of the video. Alright. Bye. Love you all. <laughs>